Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Ah, everything is good. What about you? Okay, yo dije, me abandonaron ahora, qué barbaridad, dije yo. No. <ríe> es que no veía a nadie conectado. <ríe> ok, how are you? Yeah, everything is good. It is It's a... good. Yeah. Ok, how was your day? For me, it is a lot of... A lot of work. A lot of work. Are you yeah. tired? Ah, uh, so so. So so. Yeah. Are you happy? Yeah. Okay. Because it's Friday. <laughs> yes, it's Friday. Yeah. And you learn and you, you are you are in class, right? Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. And it's is is viernes y el cuerpo lo sabe, dice. Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Excellent. Lilian, how was your day, Lilian? Hi, teacher. Hi. I'm But I'm so tired. Tired too. Yes, oh. when, uh, when a difficult week. <laughs> ah, okay. Did you have a, a bad day, right? Yes, yes. Okay. Did you have a lot of work? A lot of work. And ah. the traffic is terrible. Ay, the it's traffic terrible. is, yes, yeah, is terrible. The streets are crowded. The buses are crowded. And the micro buses are crowded too. It's, yeah, but, 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 but it is uh, every day. In the yes. morning, at the night. It is yes, in the morning, yeah, it's terrible too. <laughs> Imagine that in my case. I arrived to my house one hour, one hour after that before. Before yeah, it, I, it, I, it, I, it is confusing because the, 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 the gasoline is more expensive. And yes. Yeah, but I don't know. I have more cars. Maybe uh, I consider that the traffic is uh, to cause by, by students. This is the, the, the one thing, but the second is the motorcycle is to, to ride the, the line. In the this, correct line. Yeah. This is, yes. a, yeah. Yeah, but drive a car is, is, is better than traveling in bus, in a bus, for security, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, uh, uh, but but in the in the in the, in the actually, I'm more security for the country. Yeah, yeah, it's more security. Yeah, it's true. Yes, it's true. I agree with you. And uh, uh, Luisito, lo agregaron al grupo. Le soy honesto, no. No. Lo, no. Pero ya hice lo de lo de, de las tareas y la noche. Logró ingresar entonces ahí al, al, al sistema y todo. Sí, sí, sí. Ah, ok. Sí. Uh -huh. Vaya, pero voy a, voy a seguir, voy a reportarlo nuevamente para que lo agreguen, okay. porque, para que vea el material extra que les estoy enviando. Ok. Ok. Pero digamos en el grupo no puede escribir como que mira, agreguen a este número. O sea, ¿Cómo no? Grupo. Sí, eso hice, eso hice oh. a, ayer en la noche y puse su nombre y su número para que lo agreguen, pero voy a volver a recordarles. Bueno. Yep. How are you, Nazario? I am okay. I have Why a problem with my com I had a problem with my computer. It, ah. was a, it was a dating. Ah, your computer is lazy. Es haragana. Sometimes not ever. No. But ah, today, okay. but today had a problem. Ah, okay. But the most yes. important is that you are here, right? Yeah, I have to room. <laughs> yes, I'm my responsible. Ah, okay, I did magic that. Hi, partner. <laughs> Hi, classmate. Nazario Hi, classmate. Hi, classmate. Hi, Nazario. Good to see you, everyone. Nice to see you too, Nazario. <laughs> hey, excellent. Where are the new Where are the new classmates today? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, now, did you remember about the, our topic yesterday? I think so. 
Yeah. Yes. About what? About medications. 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 Some medicine, Some yes. Part of medicines. What part was of yesterday's topic? What uh, was the, yesterday's the, topic? The, the part parts of, of the body. Part of the body. The parts of the body. What yes. else? Uh, the common medication. Common medication. Yes. What else? Um, what about the conversation? Yeah, the conversation I used to to the I don't know. Um, that the person is, is, tell me. <laughs> tell me, Lilian. Or negative different yeah, different situation. Yes, we saw about noun and yeah. feel plus adjective. Did you remember? Yeah. Yes. Excellent. Yeah. Did you remember uh, positive things or positive um, feel plus adjective, but numbers plus positive, positive things? Yeah. About yesterday? Yeah. Positive okay. and, and, and negative. Positive yeah. and negative adjectives, right? Yeah. In negative adjectives or in, in negative adjectives, we have sick, awful, awful. Terrible, terrible, miserable. Miserable. Did you remember that? Yeah. Right? Yeah. yeah. What about the positive adjectives or positive adjectives? Fine. Fine. Great. Great. Terrific. Terrific. Fantastic. Ter terrific. Fantastic. Fantastic. Yes. Excellent. What Im imagine that Nazario has a tooth toothache. What's the matter, Nazario? Well, I'm so sick and I feel so terrible. Ah, what happened? I have a toothache. You have a toothache. I'm yeah. sorry to hear that, Nazario. You, oh, you, thank you, you take to take some medicine. I'm gonna miss the class today. Ah no, 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 no. no. You don't thank have you. a permission. <laughs> it's true. Thank you. I take I I take some aspirin. Okay, <laughs> some aspirin. Ah yeah. I take some aspirin. Yes. And what about ibuprofen? Did you like ibuprofen? ibuprofen? I don't like it, but it's okay. Yeah, because Not like it, but it, but it's okay. It's an, an anti-inflammatory. Yeah. I feel better when I drink uh, ibuprofen. Ibuprofen, excellent. Right. Now, who is Erika Erika Mendes? Erika Mendes is new. Okay. I don't know. Ever we have Anita Nazario. Okay. Now, let me to present our new topic for today. Did you study the medications vocabulary? Yes or no? Uh, no. 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 Okay. Did you have remember. the time? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you forgot the information. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But on weekends, you can study on weekend. But but are this this information only the chat group or the platform? No, in chat group. Oh, okay. Yes, only chat. But I hey. send you, I, I will send you after class in, uh, to your personal number, right? Okay, thank okay. you. After the class. I think, okay. Yeah, Yeah. I think that the information that you sent to the to the group, WhatsApp group, mm, it's yes. so wonderful. Yeah. It's so wonderful. And, and it's very important and then, too. And another one is the, the platform. Yes. Yesterday, yesterday during the night, I complete my homework. I think that we have to complete two sections, teacher. 
Yes. Section the number one and the two. number two. Yes. For another week, for another week, we have to work in number three and four, maybe. We will have only number section three for next week. Okay. But for for this night, you need to complete section one and section two, the exam. I don't. I don't. Yeah. Okay. And then there is no problem. Right. Now. ¿Quién tiene interferencia? Who has interference? Mar ah, que se escucha eh, personas hablando atrás. Ah, ahorita ya, ya no se escucha nadie. Ok. Now. Did you remember about the common medications, right? Yes. Ok. Antacid. Muscle cream. Did you remember that? Cough yeah. syrup. Cough drops, cold pills, aspirin. Yeah. Now, here we have a nice conversation. This conversation is named Don't Work Too Hard. Did you remember or did you know? Do you know what is the meaning of Don't Work Too Hard? Don't Work Too Hard. No trabajes tan fuerte. No trabajes, no trabajes tan fuerte o no trabajes tan duro. Don't work too hard o demasiado fuerte. Too también significa demasiado. Don't work too hard. Please read the, listen to the audio and read the information at the same time. Okay, now don't work too hard. Let me see. Okay, please pay attention to the pronunciation. Page 81. Page 81. Don't work too hard. Listen and practice. Hello, Ms. West. How are you today? Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Hmm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. I'm going to give you some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes. Don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. Young. Okay. Can I put again? Se los pongo de nuevo? Please, teacher. Okay. Okay. Page 81. Attention. Exercise 6. Conversation. Listen and practice. Hello, Ms. West. How are you today? Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. Hmm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. I'm going to give you some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes. Don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. Young. Okay, now I need two volunteers to read this information. Okay, me. Okay, me. Luis and Lillian. Okay, Lillian is the doctor. Okay, okay. please start, Lillian. Okay, uh, hello, Mr. Mr. Luis. How are you today? Uh, not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I am excited. Mm, why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay. Let's take a look at you. A few minutes later. <laughs> continue. I'm going to go to give you some pills. Take one pill every night after dinner. 
Okay. And don't think I don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes. Don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. Jan. Excellent. Now, listen and practice. Hello, Miss Miss Quest. How are you today? Not so good. So what's wrong exactly? I'm exhausted. I'm exhausted. Mmm. Why are you so tired? I don't know. I just can't sleep at night. Okay, let's take a look at you. A few minutes later, I'm going to give you some pills. Take one pills every night after dinner. Okay. And don't drink coffee, tea, or soda. Anything else? Yes, don't work too hard. All right. Thanks, Dr. Jan. Now, I ask you, are there any words that, that is new for you here in this conversation? New words? No, teacher, for me, it's okay. Okay. What is the meaning of all right? Todo bien. Todo bien. What is the meaning of not so good? No estoy bien. No estoy bien. O no tan bien. No tan bien. No tan bien. So, what is the meaning of so? Entonces. Entonces, what's wrong exactly? ¿Qué te pasa exactamente? ¿Qué tienes exactamente? ¿Ya? ¿O qué te pasa? I'm exhausted. I'm exhausted. What is the meaning of exhausted? Cansado. Exhausto. Cansada, exhausto. Yeah. Cansada. Very tired. Mm, why are you so tired? Why are you so tired? What is the meaning of the question? ¿Por qué estás cansada? Why are you so tired? Entonces, ¿por qué estás tan cansada? I don't know. What is the meaning of this one? I don't know. No lo sé. No lo sé. I just can't sleep at night. What is the meaning of this sentence? Yo justamente no puedo dormir esta noche. No pude dormir esta noche. I can't sleep at night. O no puede, no pude dormir en la noche. I can o no puedo dormir en la noche. Okay, let's take a look at you. What is the meaning of let's take? Let's take a look at you. Vamos a ver qué tienes o algo así. Ya. Another opinion. Let's take a look at you. Sí, vamos a ver qué tienes. Okay. O sí. tam también puede ser eh, vamos a chequearte. Okay, let's take a look. Look es mirar. ¿Ya? Mirar. Let's take a look at you. Vamos a revisarte. Vamos a mirarte. ¿Ya? Now, a few minutes later, unos minutos después, I'm going to give some pills. What is the meaning of pills? Pastillas. Píldoras o pastillas. Pills. Take one pills every night after dinner. How many pills she needs? One. Only one. Only one every dinner. Yeah. ¿Cada cuánto se la tiene que tomar? Después de la cena. Every night after sí. dinner. Después de la cena. Every day, every night, cada noche, right? Para que pueda dormir. En... What is the doctor's recommendation? Que no tome café ni soda. Don't ni drink coffee, tea, or soda. Okay, because soda is bad for your health. And coffee tea is bad for your health. Luis is drinking tea. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what, kind, what kind of, of tea do you yeah, drink? Yeah, to, to chai, chai spice. 
is the name. Ah, chai spice. Yeah. Ah, it's different. Yeah. Okay. I believe it's chamomile tea. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or ginger tea. Okay. <laughs> okay. Now, don't work too hard. What's the, the most important recommendation? Don't work too hard. No trabaje tan duro. But I consider that sometimes it's impossible because it depends the the kind of job that you have right. is is impossible yeah mm -hmm. now but we have to take a rest sometimes yes yeah. yes at least but, few minutes yes or a time dinner right yeah okay now did you like this conversation yeah it was interesting yeah. right yeah okay now continue Perdón, with tell me duda. tell me el yes just el just que función cumple al just and sleep at night el just que función cumple en la hora I, I just can't sleep at night. Le dice, ah, es que yo no puedo dormir o, o solo no puedo dormir en la noche. Porque ella le dice, yo no sé, I don't know. Yo solo no puedo dormir en la noche. Es como que diga solo no puedo dormir o, o justamente oh, no puedo dormir. Simplemente. La noche. O simplemente, simplemente también simplemente. no puedo dormir en la noche. ¿Ya? Yeah? I just can. Yo solo no puedo dormir en la noche, le dice. Solo eso sabe, o sea, nada más que solo no sabe que tiene, pero sí sabe que no puede dormir en la noche. I just can't. Eso, no, solo sé que no puedo dormir en la noche. ¿Ya? Ok. ¿Another question? No. Ok, continue with the topic. No ones. Ok, no ones. Here we have imperatives. Imperatives. Do you know what imperatives means? Imperativo. Imperativo. Okay. The function of imperative is used to express an order, a request, give. A or a suggestion. Yes, suggestions, give instructions or even to advise someone advice is aconsejar advice someone aconsejar a alguien give instructions dar instrucciones right expresa an order una orden expresa request un pedido una solicitud a request yeah give instructions and even to advise someone for example, when you you said to someone, you need to take aspirin. You need to take some aspirin. Yes, it's a, a recommendation. So it's a an order or a request. Now, se usa para expresar una orden, una petición, eh, dar instrucciones o aconsejar a alguien. Para eso es el imperativo. Here we have some examples. The first one, take a pill every four hours. This is a order, is a request, is an, extra, an instructions, or is an advice? An instruction. An instruction, what else? Okay. Advice, what else? Take a pill every four hours. Tome una píldora cada cuatro horas. Take a pill every four hours. Maybe a order. Yeah, order. Porque qué pasa si no se la toma y tiene dolor o tiene But, fiebre. Doctor say sometimes that to the patient that uh, they say I suggest that you will drink a uh, a pill every six or eight hours. Yes, but probably next day the people are worse. Va a estar peor. Yeah? 
por no seguir las indicaciones. Entonces es como una orden también, Ahí, aquí cumple todo, una orden, un request, una solicitud o una instrucción o un consejo, Pero aparte de consejo no mucho, tal vez una, una orden o una instrucción, ¿ya? Take a pill every four hours. Now, next one, rest in bed. What is the meaning of rest in bed? Descansar en la cama. Rest, it means descansar. En cama. En cama. Descansar en cama. Rest es receso, descanso. Rest in bed, descanse en la cama. Another, drink a lot of juice. Natural juice. Drink a lot of juice. Ok. In which occasion the doctor said you drink a lot of juice? When we need some vitamins, maybe. Vitamins. Yeah. Vitamins. Yeah. yeah. But when you have a sore throat, the doctor said, it yeah. is important to drink a lot of water. It is important to drink a lot of lemonade. But it not, is important but... to drink chamomile tea, tea de manzanilla. Right. Right? And if you have cough, It is important to drink ginger tea. Ginger, do you do you know what ginger is? Yeah. Ginger is? Yeah, and jengibre. Yeah. It's, it's, it's good for your health when you right. have a cough. Yeah. With with honey and lemon. Too. Yes, with honey and lemon is better. Right. Now I have a plant in my yard. <laughs> ah, okay. Don't work too hard. What is the meaning of this sentence? Don't work too hard. No trabajes, no trabajes duro. Tan fuerte. No trabajes tan fuerte, no trabajes tan duro. Don't stay up late. Don't stay up late. Go to bed early. Stay up. No, no te quedes tarde. hasta tarde. No te quedes hasta tarde. Stay, it means permanecer. ¿Ya? Yeah? No te quedes hasta tarde. Don't stay up late. And don't, early. Yes. Impossible. Don't drink soda. Don't drink soda. A I ask you. A I ask problem. you. Yes. Do you like soda, Nazario? Yes, I like it, but not so much. Ah, ok. I try to drink a glass, maybe three a week, maybe three times a week. Three times a week. Ok. What kind, uh, the question is for Lillian. What kind of drink do you prefer? Soda and juice or juice? Uh -huh. I love soda, but I prefer the juice, natural juice. Natural use, yes, it's important. Now, what but about? I... Tell me. But I love the soda. <laughs> ah, okay, yes, okay. Now, Jessica, are you there? Jessica. Yes, teacher. Hi. What kind of drink do you prefer? Soda or tea? Soda, teacher. Soda. Very okay. cool. Muy fría. What? Okay. How many times do you drink soda during the day? How many times uh, do you drink soda during the day? All day. All day. And what about water? How many times do you drink water during the day? Um, también. Okay. How uh, many? Combination. Combination. It's a combination. Okay. Cuando, cuando hablamos de, de tiempo, podemos decirlo de esta manera. Miren, les voy a enseñar acá. Acá, once, it means una vez. 
twice. Dos veces. And three times. Tres veces. Y así sucesivamente. Después de three times, puede decir four times a week, four times a day, al día. Aquí puedo decir once a week. Aquí digo, how many times do you drink, do you drink soda? Si yo digo, ah, una vez al día, entonces sería once a week. Once a, once a day. Once a, once a, una vez al día, once a day. Y si es una vez a la semana, once a week. ¿Ya? Si son dos veces, twice a week o twice a day. ¿Ya? Ya. Yeah. Now, the question is for ever. Ever? Are you there ever? A los que casi no les pregunto, porque hay algunos que como no les veo ahí la carita. Perdón. Ok, ever. How many times do you drink soda? Twice a week. Twice a week. Okay. O twice a day. No. Twice a week. Okay, excellent. Thank you. What about Luis Montano? How many times do you drink coffee? Yes. Uh, three times. Uh, three. Or th three twice. Or dice. A day. A day. Tres veces al día. Yes. Ah, three times a day. Okay. Yes. Now, the question is to... Juan is, is connected. Juan, are you there? No. no. Anita? Hi. Hi, Hi Anita. How many times do you drink chamomile tea? Te de manzanilla. How many times do you drink? Yes, I love. <laughs> okay. I love tea. Um, I don't like soda. I don't like uh, coffee. Uh, I uh, so uh, tea. <laughs> okay, congratulations. But Thank how you. many times? ¿Cuántos días, cuántas veces toma? Uh, twice uh, in the morning, in the, in the twice morning. Twice a day. And, yes, in the morning and uh, night. Ah, in the morning and at night. In at night, yes. Excellent, Anita. Thanks. Okay, now, continue with the topic. This is a once, once, twice, and three times. Now, here we have an exercise. Practice. Give an advice for each problem. Give an advice. What is the meaning of give an advice? Dar una recomendación. De y aconseje para cada problema. Uh -huh. What happened in number one? What's the uh, matter? I have a toothache. He have a, a toothache. A toothache. Toothache. Yes. What recommendation can you give him? He will drink some my ibuprofen. Some ibuprofen. Yes, take an ibuprofen. Or anaden. Anaden. What else? What other recommendation? Don't drink. Can you give? Don't drink cold water. Don't drink what? Cold water. Cold. Cold water. 
Cof o cough? Cold. No. Cold, de frío. Hello. Ah, cold water. Cold water. Ah, uh, but I don't know, but I'm not sure, yeah. but I listen that that during cold or cold or yeah, is is better for health. Yeah. But I'm Be not sure. Yeah, I'm because not sure. because there is example to the doctor extra to the to the to the to the, to the, the teeth. To the feet. It's yeah. recommended to to eating cold things, for example, ice cream. Ice cream, yes. Is true? Yeah. yeah. Now, what other advice can you give him? ¿Qué, otro, qué otra recomendación le podemos dar a él? Mm -hmm. Take a rest. Mm -hmm. Correct. Take a rest. What else? Take some analgesic. Take an analgesic oh, what else? Or, don't or injection. Eat, uh, or don't eating hard things. Don't eating? Hard things. Cosas duras. Yes. Ah, entonces pongámosle avoid, evitar, avoid. Um, any foods, algunas comidas, yeah, but I consider that the most important is call a dentist, right, or well, see visit a, a doctor, yeah, yeah, then this is the, the most important. Yeah, but, but it is but it is the most important for the four scenarios. Yes. Yes. Now, do you recommend let me see what about number 2? Continue with number 2. What kind of matter or what's what her matter? A headache. I have a headache. Ok. ¿Qué le podemos decir a ella? What is your advice for her? Take some aspirin. Take some aspirin. What else? Um, take, rest, rest take, a, take a rest. Take a rest. What else? Go to bed early. Go to bed early. What else? Injection relajante, no sé cómo se dice. Relal. Yes. And then injection. Yes, injection too. You can put a... Or take, a take some, some pills. Some people use uh, a, an ice pack in her head. Yeah, yes, yes. Put some ice pack in, in her face. But I don't know if you if you if you see some people put potato here above on the on the the ice. With al alcohol, with, with alcohol, yes. With, with, uh -huh, with potato. With potato. A slide, potato in, in a slide. Yeah. And put a bowl. Take, take yeah. the vitamins. Take vitamin. Yes. Take vitamins. Okay. Now, what about number three? What advice can you give him? I have the flu. He have the flu. 
he had the flu. Uh, drink uh, on tea. Fluids. Drink a what? Drink a, 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 a medical medical common medical um, antifluidex or virulent. No. Yes. Puede ser, take a, a, a ciraminofen for the flu. O, uh, o podría ser tea hot during, hot yes, during chamomile tea, chi, el té de manzanilla, recomiendan, ¿verdad? Cuando uno tiene gripe. And take... Oh. Y compuesto. Limonade, yes. Take limonade. What else? For the flu. What other advice? Take a tea or tea of ginger. Ginger, yeah, but ginger is when the, when people have cough. It's a <coughs> cough. Because the ginger is, is good for the sore throat. No, but okay. I think in this case, is avoid or don't hear. Don't, don't cover yourself. Don't cover yourself with clothing. Why? Because if people, if, if he has fever, it's bad idea to cover with, with any kind of cloth. Le dicen or, a uno que no se envuelva, right? Or, Porque or, aguarda más calor. Or, or temp temperature is up. Yes. So we can have to wear a lot of clothes. Above yes. us. Take a cloth for me. Repeat, please. Take a cloth for me. So, so ah, yes. Minute. Yes. Drink a uh, or take a uh, eh, chlorphenyramine. Chlorphenyramina, right? Doctor suggests drink a lot of water. Drink a lot of water. A lot of water. Now, next one, number four. I can't I can't sleep at night. What advice? I can't sleep at night. Él no puede dormir en la noche. What is your recommendation? What is your advice to him? Don't drink coffee is one. Excellent. Don't drink coffee. Or don't drink or don't eat, drink or eat products uh, with um, uh, um, okay. with much sugar, for example. Ah, yeah. And then don't drink or eat some food that contain sugar sugar yeah it's very important and a nice advice is take a shower before go to sleep right take a shower yeah. and eat early Early. It early is a good idea too. Okay. Read Excellent. A book. Ah, read a book. Read a book. It's a good idea. Yes. Read a book. Or meditation. Okay. For meditation. Yeah. yeah. Excellent. Don't watch television. Maybe. Don't watch. Oh, avoid. Avoid television. Avoid. Washing TV. Okay. Now, continue with. Here we have some examples. 
about the, the answers, the sensors. Take any pills, take a rest, drink tea, go to bed, take acetaminophen, take a shower, drink a lemonade, drink a ginger tea, drink a chamomile tea, you don't drink coffee before to sleep, take a pill and listen to classical music. Yes, here we have some examples about the answers. Now, this is our final topic of session two. This is a reading, simple ways to improve your health. Believe it or not, you can greatly improve your health in 10 simple ways. No sé si ustedes en sus clases anteriores les han comentado cómo leer una parte. Cómo leer, cómo utilizar el scamming y el skinning. No. No. Okay. No. no. But this is a good idea. Cuando usted tiene una... Digamos, esto lleva, lleva, son cortitos, pero hay unos que son, que son eh, párrafos largos. Entonces, hay una técnica que se llama scanning. Scanning significa escanear. Entonces, si usted quiere saber de qué trata la lectura, puede empezar leyendo las primeras dos líneas y en cada párrafo, suponiendo que estos son párrafos diferentes, usted lee la primera línea o dos líneas, si es un párrafo largo, Luego lee el final, una línea del final, del siguiente párrafo igual, una línea o dos. Y al final también, el tercer párrafo puede leer unas tres líneas, una del inicio, una de en medio y una del final. Y así sucesivamente. Así va a tener una idea de qué trata el artículo sin necesidad que lo haya leído todo. Eso se llama skimming, que es... Eh, ir viendo por poquitos. Ahora, el, el, el scanning también, que es escanear el documento, ahí sí alguien les hace, ustedes como ya, vi, ya utilizaron la primera técnica, que es el, el skimming, de ir viendo por poquitos, ya tener una idea de qué trata. Por ejemplo, si alguien les dice, en el, le dice, ¿dónde? Digamos que es una creación de empresas, el... el el reading se trata de una creación de empresas. Y le dicen en una pregunta, ¿quién creó la primera empresa en el país? Por ejemplo. Entonces usted como ya ha visto algo de qué trata, ya se va a ir con el scanning. Escanear es ya ir directamente a buscar la respuesta de la pregunta que le están haciendo. Si esa respuesta está en la primera parte, entonces ya se va directamente a buscar la respuesta. Ahí ve la, la, lo que le están preguntando. Por ejemplo, si dice que quién creó la primera empresa, usted puede buscar la palabra crear o la palabra empresa y ahí va a encontrar la respuesta. Esa es una buena técnica cuando son párrafos largos, que usted quiere saber más o menos de qué se trata. Es bueno esto, esta técnica. Lo pueden intentar con algo el fin de semana. Sí. Lean así por poquitos y después ya el scanning es ya ir el, ya a la forma extracta, ya sacar la respuesta de lo que le están preguntando. Right? All right. Ok. Good idea. Yes, it's a good idea. Now, uh, please read the, the information, but at the same time listen. Ok, pay attention to them. This one, let me see. Simple ways. Ten, ten simple ways to improve your health. Believe it or not, you can greatly improve your health in ten simple ways. One, eat breakfast. Breakfast gives you energy for the morning. Two, Go for a walk. Walking is good exercise, and exercise is necessary for good health. Three, floss your teeth. Don't just brush them, 
Flossing keeps your gums healthy. Four, drink eight cups of water every day. Water helps your body in many ways. Five, stretch for five minutes. Stretching is important for your muscles. Six, wear a seat belt. Every year, seat belts save thousands of lives. Seven, do something to challenge your brain. For example, do a crossword puzzle or read a new book. Eight, protect your skin. Use lots of moisturizer and sunscreen. Nine, get enough calcium. Your bones need it. Dairy foods like yogurt, milk, and cheese have calcium. Ten, take a time out, a break of about twenty minutes. Do something different. For example, get up and walk, or sit down and listen to music. Okay. Now, in number one, please repeat after me. Eat breakfast. Eat breakfast. Eat breakfast. Eat breakfast. Breakfast gives you energy for the morning. Breakfast give you energy for the morning. Number two, go for a walk. Go for a walk. Walking is good exercise. Walking, Walking is good exercise. And exercise is necessary for good health. Health. In exercise necessary for good health. Number three, flush your teeth. Flush your teeth. Don't just brush them. Don't just brush them. Flushing keeps your gums healthy. Number four, drink eight cups of water every day. Drink a cup of water every day. Water helps your body in many ways. Water helps your body in many ways. Number five, stretch for five minutes. Stretching. Stretching is important for your muscles. Number six, wear a seat belt. Wear wear a seat belt. Every year, seat belts save thousands of lives. Every year. Okay, in number one, do you have uh, any questions about this vocabulary in number one? No, teacher. No. Dice que el desayuno le da energía para la mañana. Ya? Yeah? In number two, go for a walk. Do you have any questions about new words? In number two? No, no, no. Dice que caminar es, es bueno para la salud, es un buen ejercicio, dice, y es un ejer ejercicio necesario para una buena salud. Now, number three, do you have any questions about new words? Yes, uh, flush. Flush. What is the meaning of flush? Ya. Yeah? Es hilo dental. Hilo dental. Hilo dental ah. para de los dientes. Ya, yeah, okay. hilo dental. Yeah. Ajá, hilo dental. Flush your teeth. Dice, don't just brush them. Dice que no solo lo cepille. No Dice que el flushing, que es el hilo dental, mantiene sus encías saludables. Gums son encías. Mantiene sus encías saludables. What about number four? Drink a cup of water every day. Do you have any questions about number four? No. No. Dice, water helps your body in many ways. Dice que el agua le ayuda a su cuerpo en diferentes maneras. Now, number five. Do you have any questions? No. Nope. What is the meaning of stretch? 
El estrés. Slide de foto. Slide de foto. Yes. Ok. Estirarse. Es estirarse. ¿Ya? Stretch. Estirarse, dice, por cinco minutos. Dice que el estiramiento es importante para sus músculos. Number six. Do you have any questions? Where are set belt? What is the meaning of set belt? Cinturón de seguridad. Cinturón de seguridad. Set belt. Every year, dice cada año, el cinturón de seguridad le guarda miles de vidas. Now, number seven, do something to challenge your brain. For example, do a crossword puzzles or read a new books. Do you have any questions about number seven? Do something to challenge your brain? No. No. Sure. no. Dice que eh, hay cosas que cambian, que cambian su mente, le dan un cambio a su mente. Por ejemplo, dice, hacer una, un crossword puzzle. What is the meaning of puzzles? Un crucigrama. Rompecabezas. Crucigrama, rompecabezas, yeah. Crossword puzzle. O read a new book. Dice, hacer un, un crucigrama o leer un nuevo libro. Now, number eight, protect your skin. Use a lot of moisture and sunscreen. Protect your skin. What? Okay. Do you have any questions about this one? No, teacher. What, okay, is, the, what is the moisturizer? Moisture. Dice que, dice que es, es pro, para proteger su piel. Usted dice muchas cremas y cremas eh, sunscreen son las cremas para el sol. También o protectores solares. Muy hidratantes. Hidratantes también, ya. Yeah. Moisturizer. Yes. Now, number nine. Get enough calcium. Your bones need it. Dairy foods like yogurt, milk and cheese have calcium. Do you have any questions about number nine? Bones. Bones Muerte. son huesos. Ah, nuestros huesos. Bones. Bones. Nuestros huesos. Dice que hay que tener, hay que adquirir suficiente calcio, dice. Que sus huesos lo necesitan. Diary Dairy. foods. What is the Diaria meaning of diary foods? Diariamente. Alimentos no, diarios. Esos son los, son los, los, oh, eh, daily, los daily. quesos. Daily foods son los alimentos de queso, son los lácteos. I roll daily, sorry, teacher. Ah, ok. Daily son lácteos. Daily foods, like yogur, milk, and cheese. Todos son lácteos. Have calcium. Todos esos tienen calcium. Tiene calcio. Now, number 10. Take a time out, a break of about 20 minutes. Do something different. Do something different. For example, get, get up and walk or sit down and listen to music. What is the meaning of time out? Un tiempo fuera. Un, un tiempo fuera o un respiro. Sí. En pocas Exacto. palabras, tome un respiro, dice, o un break de por lo menos 20 minutos. Dice que haga algo diferente, por ejemplo, eh, camine, dice, o puede sentarse y escuchar música. ¿Ya? Ya. Sí. Here we have some simple ways to improve your health. ¿Ya? Excelente. Now, hasta aquí termina la sección 2. Ahora necesito que me digan qué les ha parecido esta semana y si quieren que se haga algún cambio diferente o algo que no les haya parecido o que quieran que se, que se incorpore a la clase. Aparte del material extra que les he estado enviando. ¿Qué les ha parecido? La idea es que no se vayan a salir ustedes. Es importante que sigan como grupo. Ahora que ustedes manden ya la información que tienen, eh, los exámenes, ya al finalizar el módulo les van a dar su diploma. Recuerden que el inglés abre, abre muchas, 
puertas. Y en algunos casos hay personas que por algún motivo vienen una, dos semanas y se salen, no sé por qué. O sea, no, no me ha pasado a mí en, los, en las clases anteriores, los grupos eh, se han mantenido, pero en muchas ocasiones eh, comentan eso, que, que la gente se sale. Entonces, eh, es por eso que les pregunto, porque a mí me gusta que si ustedes sienten que están aprendiendo, está bien, pero si quieren que se incorpore algo más, lo incorporamos para la otra clase, ya con los otros temas que vienen. ¿Qué les ha parecido hasta ahorita? Opinions, please. ¿En inglés o en español? <risa> Whatever. Excelente. <risa> Excelente, ok. Well, for me, teacher, for me, it's okay, teacher. I think that I'm trying to, to learn every day and put in practice your suggestion and read, obviously. And my goal is not only to, my goal is not only to, to complete the, the, the level. My vision is to, comp uh, to learn English and speak flu fluently. Fluency. Excellent, excellent. Congratulations. So I know everybody knows how responsibly and put in practice the 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 English every day. I yeah. think so for me, for me the cures is, is wonderful. Okay, excellent. Thanks a lot. Sí, es, recuerden que el aprendizaje de inglés tiene que ser continuo y hay que aprovechar las oportunidades. Nunca dejen de ir las buenas oportunidades. Hay que seguir, hay que luchar. Si a veces si llegan bien cansados de su trabajo, dice uno, ay, qué cansado vengo. Y a veces no le dan ganas de, de conectarse, pero ya conectado, ya es otra historia, ya le gusta estar ahí. ¿Verdad? Es como levantarse temprano que uno va a correr. Yo a veces voy a correr, fíjense. A mí me gusta salir a correr en la mañana. Ah, pues a veces no me dan ganas de levantarme, pero ya, ya levantada y empiezo a correr, ya me gustó. Entonces, eh, es bueno continuar continuar y no dejar, no, no desaprovechar las oportunidades. Y es, more opinions, porque ya es la hora de terminar. Pero... Yeah, for, for me, it is a, a excellent uh, classmate and, and, and you. Uh, it is, it is a, a very interesting uh, every day. It is a, a, a wonderful for me. Okay, thanks a lot. More opinions. O si después de la clase quieren hacer algún comentario, me pueden escribir, no, there is no problem, ¿ya? Porque ya es la hora de terminar. O también si tienen dudas con la plataforma, igual me dicen para los, los ejercicios que tienen que mandarlos ahora antes de la medianoche, right Right, teacher, it's true. Ok. Right. And see you on Monday. Ok. Have a nice weekend. Have a nice weekend. And God bless you and thanks for coming. Okay. Have a nice, have a nice weekend, everyone. Okay. Have a nice, have a nice weekend. Night. Goodbye. See, See you on Monday. Monday. See you Monday. Bye bye. bye.